welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me in today's video. So as you guys can see, I am joined by a special guest. Hi. This is Selena. If you guys do not know her, I can't help you. I, I just can't help you. Anyway, today I am doing another sleigh formation on Selena. And I did this beautiful kind of sultry dark burgundy eyes with like nude lips and popping highlight for days yes queen yes so yeah don't forget to check out my link in the description bar because we did a collab on her channel which is so amazing with my ate <laughs> <laughs> Guys, you definitely do not want to miss it. It's absolutely amazing. And yeah, if you guys would like to see this look, then please keep watching. So first things first, we're going to start off with the eyebrows. And I'm using my Benefica brow in the shade number 5 on her eyebrows. And I'm just going to be filling them in. She has a really good brow shape, so there's not much work I actually had to do. I literally just fill them in. And then I'm taking my Maxilla cover-up. This is in the shade NC42. And I'm going to just highlight under her brow and kind of give the brow a little bit of a lift. You know what I'm saying? So then for primer, I'm using the Kiki Beauty Makeup Ready Face Primer and just putting that all over her face. For foundation, I'm taking the MAC Studio Fix Fluid in the shade NC45 and just blending that onto her skin. And then I'm taking a damp beauty blending sponge and just making sure that the foundation is blending in quite well. And then for concealer, I'm taking my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Medium Beige and I'm just going to be highlighting under her eyes, down the center of her face, cube as well, and chin. And then blending that all out. Next, I'm taking my Yardley Absolute Translucent Powder and I'm going to use this to bake all of the areas that we've just highlighted. I'm especially putting the powder under the eyes to just catch any eyeshadow that may fall out. And then I'm going in with my Jaclyn Hill Times Morphe palette and taking the shade Puta, using this as my first transition shade. And I'm dusting this all the way from the outer corner of the eye to the inner corner of the eye and using light windshield wiper motions. Next, taking the shade Mocha and adding a little bit more definition on the outer corner of the eye and then taking that into the crease. And then going in with the shade Jax and as you can see, I'm working it lower down than that Mocha shade just because I want to tie the transition shades into the lid shade that I'm going to apply just now as you guys will see so just making sure everything is nicely blended and not forgetting to take all of these eyeshadows on the lower lash line as well taking the shade crayon apple and I'm just gonna start packing this all over the lid this is such a beautiful cranberry shade I absolutely love it I think it is so complimentary on so many brown girls so then I'm gonna be taking some sissy and this is like a rose golden shade and I just want to open up the eyes just a little bit more so I'm going to start packing this right on the inner corner of the eye and then to brighten up the inner corners I'm using the shade in light next taking the <laughs> I was gonna say next taking the shade Ingla Gel Liner in the number 77. <laughs> I'm gonna be taking my Ingla Gel Liner and I mixed it with some Juraline to make it easier to work with and I'm just drawing her wings. And then I'm taking my LA Girl Glide Gel Liner Pencil. This is in the shade Very Black and I'm just gonna be lining her lower waterline. And then she is applying some Benefit Roller Lash Mascara for me. For bronzing, I'm taking my Physician's Formula 
butter bronzer and I'm just going to warm up the skin just a little bit so that we can build up the dimension on the face and I'm using my LA Girl HD Pro Powder. This is in the shade Coco and I'm just chiseling out our face and the contour brush I'm using is from Shintari if you guys are interested. And then I'm going to be dusting away all of the bake and taking this blush from my Dew Factory 9B blush palette and I'm just going to be applying this onto her cheeks making sure it blends in really well and for highlight basically the star of the show this is Anastasia Beverly Hills So Hollywood you guys can see how beautiful it looks on her skin oh my goodness it is blinding and then I'm taking the Ilio number 117 lashes and I'm going to be sticking these on her eyes and I'm using the Ilio clear lash adhesive and then for Setting spray, I was going to say for setting the face, I'm going to be using the Cold Citrus Setting Spray by Kiki Beauty. And then I asked her to just line her lips for me with my MAC Plum Lip Liner. So taking my Switch Beauty Ulti Matte Palette and taking this like, almost like corally sort of nude shade. And I'm just going to be applying this all over the lips, blending it in with that plum lip liner. And then taking these two like baby pinky nudie shades and mixing them together and putting them on the center of the lips to add a little bit more dimension. What do you think of your makeup? Shit. I told you I say shit a lot. <laughs> Look at my eyebrows. Eyebrows. What? Eyebrows. My eyes. My lips. I really, really like my lips. It's like Kylie but like natural. No look Oh for my needed. word. It looks so nice. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, I'm ready to go Thank out you now. for being on my channel. Thank you for being on my channel. It was such channel. a pleasure being your face, guys. We low-key look like sisters. Like, if you, if you look really quick, you would think we were sisters. And our initials are SN and SN. We're both Nidals with a double O. Oh, guys, also one more thing. Saneshni is really, 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 really tiny in real life. Like, she looks like a full-grown, normal-sized person. <laughs> but she's so cute. She's, like, tiny and... She's very cute, guys. She's only saying this because she's taller than me, guys. And she says her forehead looks big on camera, but I also feel but like my does. face is huge. It's That's not how it looks in real life, guys. Yeah, you guys need to Even see me, I feel life. like I'm going this way now, but... Mm -mm. Like, now on camera, my face looks like this, but in real life, it's actually this. this. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Just saying. We're going to buy milkshakes now, because we like to eat. Yeah. Unhealthy. We like to be fat. Hashtag That's why we need life. contour to make us faces look slim. <laughs> <laughs> so that is pretty much it for this video you guys I really hope you enjoyed watching me do another slay formation on Selena you guys typically do like these slay formations and don't forget to check out her channel because we did a collab on her channel which is going to be amazing y'all are not ready for that okay <laughs> it's bomb.com so thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to slay all day every day with and without makeup and, and I'll subscribe. talk to you guys oh and subscribe to her channel and my channel and I'll talk to you guys in my next video Bye! They look so nice. Brows on fleek. I have high brows. <laughs> high brows I got. Can you really do or something? I don't know, he looks Indian. Oh, that's a nice green. It's a. Is it green? Yeah. I just stuck my hand into this. Bloopers. Ooh, this is such a nice color. I'm like, where is this boyfriend who's gonna buy me a damn flip in Cameron? Cameron. Cameron. <laughs> oh, there's, that's his name. That's his name. Oh, look at my that teeth. Is, that's his name. No, that's not his name. No, but it was a combination of camera and Canon. <laughs> a Cameron. I want a Cameron camera. Oh. Girl! <laughs> Shit! Boyfriend's gonna have a heart attack.